Hey guys, it's Tanika and today's video is another Kmart haul. I just can't stay away, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I've got a variety of things here to show you from accessories, clothing, a few little bits and bobs. So if you'd like to see what I picked up, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and stay tuned. First up, I picked up this, is it chenille? Chenille, I don't really know how to say it, but it's like that really soft, silky wool feeling. Anyway, it's a nude colored jumper. I actually picked up a jumper last year of the same material and it was so freaking warm and it's still going strong. So for $20, I had to pick up another one. I'll insert a little try on so you can see it better. So as you can see, it's got a bit of a detailing down the center here and the same on the sleeves. I did pick this one up in a size 10 to 12 because I wanted a bit more of a baggy fit. I absolutely love it and it is a so damn warm. Next, I picked up this freaking cute as jumpsuit. Oh my God, as soon as I saw it, I was like, come to mama. So this one I got in a size eight and it was $20. It has this black, white and khaki stripe pattern. It cinches in at the waist, it's like an elastic. And then it's also got a tie if you want to cinch yourself in a little bit more. It comes with pockets and the length is that collot style. So it's in between your knee and your ankle. I really, really love those style of pants. So I am just obsessed with this. It has a zip up the back here so it's easy to slip into. And the front even has one of these little clips. Like if it's showing too much cleavage, you can clip it together, put the girls away. I thought this was a really good find. I think it's something you can wear casually with just like a pair of slides, or if you want to dress it up, a pair of heels would look absolutely amazing with this. Next, I picked up some basic t-shirts. This is the relaxed tee in the shade cinnamon and this one was six dollars so i find the material of these ones to be really nice and breathable it says on the tag it's australian grown cotton i got it in a size eight and it does have a pocket detail on the front here i also picked this up in like a dusty mauve color as well mauve mauve I don't know. Anyway, the back is a little bit longer than the front, which I don't really like if I'm just wearing it like, like a normal t-shirt. But what I usually do is tie the front up in a little knot. So that gets rid of that longer back. And I just think it looks a bit more stylish. Moving on to some more wintry pajamary things. I picked up this new dressing gown. The one I have now, I got from Best and Less and I've had it for like four or five years maybe. Like it's getting on, the pockets are ripped. I can't put anything in them. It's It was just time for a new one. But my only requirement was that it must have a hood. Having a hood on a dressing gown is just like the best thing ever. <laughs> So I actually got this one in the men's section. It's a size small and it was $25. It actually feels so freaking soft. I'm not sure how long it's going to last after a few washes. Uh, I don't know. Some Kmart stuff is actually decent quality. So hopefully this one is. The length is just past my knees, which I really like. It's nice and cozy. It's not too short and it's just big and fluffy and it's going to be perfect as we go into these cooler months. Next, I picked up a pair of slippers. I've actually been wearing them, so I hope they're not too grotty. These were from the women's section. I think they were like $12. I got the size nine to 10 because I've got a giant ass foot. What I like about these ones is that they have like a hard sole. So it actually provides a bit of support when you're wearing them around the house. It's not like you're just ugh, trying to get it back of my foot. It's not like you're just walking around on this thin little slipper on the hard tiles. They are so cozy and warm. The inside is lined with like this furry material. Love them. I look forward to getting a new pair of slippers every winter. It's like the best. And then lastly for the winter gear, I picked up a two pack of these really 
fluffy warm socks. This pack of two was only $5. You can't go wrong there. Everyone needs some nice comfy socks for when they get home and they want to snuggle up in their dressing gown and their socks with a cup of tea. Oh, love it. Next, I've got some accessories. I am just obsessed with the Kmart accessory section. Firstly, I brought a lot of hair stuff. Now that I'm growing my hair back, I'm just like, what else can I buy? What else can I put in my hair? So these scrunchies come in a two pack for $5. This is the first style. So I've got a nice dark, please focus, like forest green color. And as you can see, it's got the bow detail with a little gold loop in the middle. And then that one also come with a black. I just thought these were super cute. The colors and that little gold detail just mm. And then I got another pack of scrunchies, also two for $5. These have the bow detail as well, but they're just kind of tied onto the scrunchie. So this one come in black and leopard. These ones here are like a silky filling material. They're not just plain cotton. And these ones are more of a ribbed material. I hope you can see the detail. Oh, so pretty, obsessed. And then next I picked up this headband. Oh my gosh. So this is more of a teal shade. And as you can see, it's got the knot detail up the top. Let me just throw it on there. I just think it is such a cute headband. The color I am obsessed with. It also come in like a rusty color like this. My little hair accessory collection is starting to grow quite rapidly and I don't think it's going to slow down anytime soon if Kmart keeps bringing out bangers like these. Next, I only got one pair of earrings. I thought these were so cute. Oh my gosh. So they've got that tortoise shell looking pattern that has been quite popular at the moment. And then just a small gold detail up the top. These were only $4 and just... I love earrings like this that aren't too bold. It's just a nice, subtle way to jazz up an outfit. Next, I was in the cosmetic beauty area and I found this three pack of Garnier masks for only $9. So I've tried all of these masks separately and absolutely love them. We've got two sheet masks and one of the eye masks. I think they retail for like four or $5 each. So you're getting three. For $9. Bargain. And then if you didn't know, I am currently planning my wedding for next year. I have a sample save the date coming in the mail. So once that's all good, I'll order some more. But I thought I would pick up a few things to help me. So I got these cute little foil heart stickers. And I'm going to use these to seal the envelope. I just thought that would be real cute. They had a bunch on Etsy that were adorable, but they were like 10 bucks a pack. And I'm like, no. These ones were only $3 a pack and you get 50 stickers. Like you just can't beat it. And then I also picked up some of this magnetic tape. This was $6. And what I'm going to do is cut off a little bit and stick it on the back of my save the date so people can put it on their fridge. All right, well, that is everything I picked up from Kama this time round. Let me know down below in the comments what your favorite item was. I hope you enjoyed watching today's video. And if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you're new, please have a look around and feel free to subscribe. If you want to see some more Kmart hauls, I will list my playlist down below. Lots of Kmart goodness down in there. So check it out. Well, I hope you're all having a great day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.